Greetings, in this video I'm going to help you troubleshoot a Samsung Galaxy Tab that is no longer connecting to the Wi-Fi. Could be a pretty simple fix, doesn't matter what version of the Samsung Tab that you have. First thing I want, what I want you to do is swipe down from the very top, click here on the Wi-Fi, and let's see, and go ahead and toggle your Wi-Fi icon on and off like three or four times. Okay, see if that will make it work. Try toggling on and off your airplane mode, which looks like a little airplane. Off, on, off, on. See if that will work. If you have the data light on, that basically is your Verizon or your T-Mobile or whatever. And if it's on, go ahead and toggle it off and see if that will work if you're trying to get the Wi-Fi to work. You could turn off Bluetooth, see if that will get it to issue to work. Now, it could be just an issue with your Wi-Fi uh, router in your home. Search the Wi-Fi router the, in, at the home. Bring the tablet close. See if it will work. And if it does work, then you know that you're not close enough to the router. Or you can have other people on the network. So they're watching TV or playing Fortnite or whatever. And that could slow it down. You'll just have to um, bring the tablet closer or have other people take their... Uh, their devices off the network temporarily if you want to get your tablet to work. All right, if you've already toggled and you've done everything, what I want you to do is try a different network. And to do that, just go to settings, go to connections, and go to Wi-Fi. And then in here, make sure you're connected to the right network because it could be that you accidentally are on someone else's network and then try a different network and see if it will work. Um, if it if it uh, works on a different network, it could be something with your router. So what you could do is reset your router, and what you could do is there's a reset button on it, or you could just unplug your router in your home for a good 30 minutes, plug it back in, and that a lot of times will fix the issue. Go to a friend's house or a family member's house, see if it will work on another router. It might not be an issue with your tablet. Okay. Now what I want you to do is to forget the network that you're trying to use and click that little icon, that little gear shift thing here. Click on that. And then down here, what I want you to do is click forget network. Just, just know that you've got to remember your password. Forget it and then go back into it. Find it again on the available networks. Click it again and put in your password. And then see if that will fix the issue. A lot of times that'll do it. Next thing what I want you to do is uh, reset the network. And so what you want to do is go back to home, go to settings again. And then from there, what I want you to do is go to general maintenance or general, general management rather, which is down here on the bottom of the settings. And then from there, what I want you to do is what I want you to do from there is go to reset. Let's see here. Where is reset? Reset there. And then from, uh, then what you're going to do is reset, reset. Uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth settings, all right? And then restart the, the tablet and see if that will fix the issue. A lot of times, that right there will fix the issue alone. Now, next thing what I want you to do is just to look for any updates. And, of course, you don't have internet connection, but you can try. Go to settings, and then from settings, what I want you to do is uh, look for system update. And let's see if we can find it here. Software update right here. And download and install. But again, it might not let you because you don't have Wi-Fi, but at least try to do that. Next thing what I want you to do is to do a factory reset. And that's going to wipe out everything on the tablet, unfortunately. Um, if you haven't tried it yet, if you've just recently installed an app, in the last week or the last day. For example, let's say you installed uh, Facebook, for example. Go ahead and uninstall it. Restart the, the tablet and see if it works it again. It could be something with that app, okay? That could fix the issue. Another thing you could do is force restart the, the, the tablet, all right? And to force restart, what you wanna do is hold the power button down, not the power button, yeah, hold the power button down and the volume down button, which is going to be on the very far, the two sets together. 
you want to hold the volume down button and the power down at the same time. And it'll take about 20 or 30 seconds. Sometimes it can be on the very top. And then it'll completely shut down, restart, and see if that will fix it. A lot of times that will fix the issue with your Wi-Fi. To do a factory reset, again, it'll make it like it's brand new out of the box. It'll wipe out all your pictures and videos and all that. But it might be your last case scenario is go to settings. And then what you're going to do from settings is uh, where we go. Uh, we're going to look for reset. Go to general management. Then click reset. And then you want to do a factory data reset. Reset your tablet to its factory default settings. This will erase all data. And that should fix the issue. All right, let me know in the comments section which version that I showed you did help. And also let me know what version tablet that you have. Do you have an A9, A9 Plus, a 10? What do you have? All right, make sure you subscribe. Thanks.